In next three minutes, yes, three minutes, we are going to convert this Raspberry Pi, this $15 device into a truly AirPlay 2 device, which we can connect to any of our speakers and make those speakers smart. Now, my previous video was very long, 20 minutes long. I've explained everything, but this time I've made it very simple with just two scripts that I've created and you have to run only two commands to, you know, deploy this AirPlay device. So after flashing the SD card with the Raspberry Pi OS Lite version and enabling the SSH from the Raspberry Pi Imager, you have to connect the card to the Raspberry Pi, then connect the OTG cable with the Raspberry Pi Zero and then you have to connect a USB DAC. Now these are the cheap accessories that you can buy for a few dollars. The cost of this project will not exceed $25 or 2000 rupees. And after this, when you connect the power supply, you can use any USB power supply. This does not need a lot of power. So you can connect to your music systems USB port if that has one. And then once this is on, you have to go to your iPhone and there you have to install and open the app called Termius. In the Termius, you have to go to connections and enter the IP address of your Raspberry. Pi. Now, if you want to know the IP address of your Raspberry Pi, you can basically go to your router's DHCP settings or use a NetScan or Fing app to basically scan your network and find the IP address of your Raspberry Pi Zero. Once you have found, just enter the IP address tap on connect or the return key and next you have to type the username which you set up during the flashing of the SD card then tap on connect next you have to enter the password tap on connect and this will show you a prompt you have to just accept it and once you accept it you are into the Raspberry Pi now here you have to just copy and paste the two commands that are listed in the description uh, just copy those paste and that's it that's all you have to do press the enter key and sit back and relax grab a coffee or something or you can watch a few reels and by the time you finish it your apple airplay device will be ready once the installation finishes you will see the installation successful message and at this stage you can basically connect the 3.5 mm jack to the usb DAC which is connected to your raspberry pi and the other end to the music systems aux input port and on your iPhone, just tap on the AirPlay and choose the Pi AirPlay device. By default, we have named it Pi Zero AirPlay. So this will show up in your AirPlay devices. You just have to tap on it and boom, you will start hearing music from your music system, which is playing wirelessly. So even if your music system does not have Bluetooth or like it's a very old age old device, you can make it smart and you can stream music on this device from anywhere in your home till you are connected to your local network. Or Wi-Fi network. So anyone in your home with iPhone or iPad can stream music to this device from anywhere and you can build such multiple devices as I said uh, using this cheap $25 project. Now this script took me a lot of time and a lot of effort to make. I wanted to make it easier for everyone to you know deploy AirPlay and make their old speakers smart. That's the purpose, preventing your classic music system from going into the trash. Now, if you like my effort, please hit the like button and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.